goodbye to a deeply good friend, an HP Windows 8 with some stylish keys, a laptop, and a little, I forget what this thing was called, but back then they were like pretty good. So then, basically you have a CD import, well, that's what's making it working now. Then you had USB, the fan, then you had the um, battery clip in the back sometimes. But we're going to say goodbye to it in a few seconds. So, let's get ready to watch. One, a drill bit with spikes. Two, Dewalt drill. Three, Dewalt adapter for 20 volt batteries. So, let's begin the demo. Now, never do this. No safety glasses, okay? Just run off the bat. And just to make sure that anybody at home was thinking about trying this. going through. I don't know what the hell is going on. It ain't going through, but... Not too bad. Got some holes. Screen's probably cracked inside, but I didn't open it up yet. Backside. Ooh, paneling showing. There's some bent metal here. No oh, man, it took the fan to town. Boy, look at that. Let's find out what the next destructive item will be. I should probably move this horse closer to see more construction happen to this. I swear on everything. Bruh. You can't even tell, like, you can tell where the little points are. But dude, I don't know if this thing will still turn on. Nope, ain't turned on. It's still dead. Damn, I wish I would have showed you to turn it on before. But damn, nothing destruction, okay? So now, we're going old school on it. It's what everyone expected. A hatchet with a hammer on the back of it. Let's find out what happens. Okay, got some good damage so far. Damn. And this continuation. Blowing it apart all things, Oreos in the vlog. Hey buddy. So damage. Glass exploded. Woohoo! Look at that mother humper. Keys are gone. Ooh, space bar's gone. Alright, what's the next tool of destruction we should use on this? I do not know, but man, it cracked it up pretty good. Full on axe, man. If you ever want to get back at your boyfriend for leaving him, you should just beat the shit out of his PlayStation. <laughs> so, yeah. Bare hands. It's going to be the last item. Don't know if it's going to take much to break it more. Gangsta shit. And glasses everywhere. 
Computer is totally destroyed. Glass is totally beating the piss out of it. I think I broke my finger because it's all red now. No blood. Still good. Keyboard is beating the hell. Keyboard is actually coming off. Got a burning sensation in my arm. Keyboard. Goodbye. Okay. There's all essential computers and shit. Ooh, those screws are just coming out. Oh, I think it's electric. I think it's that me, man. The battery blew off. But holy shit. It did some destruction, man. So, what did we learn in today's videos? If you want to get rid of some evidence, or blackmail, or kill someone and get rid of their shit, just either beat the shit out of it with your hand, or just take an axe to it. So, I would say that's grade aid anomalation of what happens when you beat the crap out of technology. Now, warning. In the following video, or in the video that you just watched, I was not in control myself to be. No, I'm good. But no. Basically, it's more or less, you gotta have self control. You gotta know what happens. So when you basically, these things are meant to last, but if you treat them right, they will last. Cause man, this thing is beat to hell. Look at this thing, man. My hands are covered in bits of glass. All right, now I got a lot of cleanup to do. And then we go and following the sleeping black bass. Hey, buddy! End the video! No? Okay, bye. The following video that you have just seen where I beat the crap out of this HP Windows 8 Intel laptop, there was no real damage, there was no real harm in the construction of this video. Nobody got hurt. Everyone's fine. I am alive. My hands are okay, because I did show them in the video, and everything is fine. So I just want to say, do not try this at home. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.